I, I'm, I'm just going to say it. I want containers to die. I really do. I want containers to die a horrible death. The fact that containers, uh, Docker containers specifically, are LXC and they're a Linux container technology is limiting them. And I want micro VMs to win. I want it to be so easy to make a VM that can integrate with the underlying GPU, which you can't do with a container, not easily, because it's, it's, it's the whole container problem. So micro VMs should win. Because if you use a micro VM, then you don't get the problem of not being able to run a Docker container on Windows or Mac or something like that. You cannot have containers, Docker-ish containers, including Podman-ish and all those containers, without Linux. That means that all the technologies that are running uh, to support containers on Windows and other platforms have to have a micro VM already. They have to have a micro Linux VM that then runs the container engine that then can run Linux containers, but that gives up the ability to do anything else with the VM. If I could configure the micro VM instead of using a VM that's going to run, you know, it's going to poorly run LXC containers because I'm on Windows. And this all came about because uh, we're actually looking at a thread here that is is a problem because github run uh, windows runners are are hobbled and there's a few people here that are making comments that are somewhat naive because they're saying the fact that windows runners don't have feature parity with linux runners from a company owned by microsoft is baffling you know what it's not baffling if you're not an idiot if you've been following this at all you, you know that linux containers are a linux technology docker containers are linux technology they're not a microsoft technology they can never ever run on windows and to make that comment means you don't understand that you have to have linux there in the first place so the actual fix for something like this is it you know the pms are all you know they're kind of being overworked down here you can read it for yourself and pause the video but the point is that vms are better they're just better across the board for everything and now that we have firecracker and all the different micro vm technologies that are emerging we're starting to and you know the stuff that that, that ubuntu, ubuntu and canonical have done uh, Canonical specifically has done with like configuring micro VMs or, you know, this is way, way better for our architecture and our world. In fact, I would love to see Kubernetes die. I really would. I would love to see Kubernetes die because it's a total container technology and have some technology come along to replace it. And I'm going to predict this is going to happen. This is going to happen within the next five to 10 years. There's going to be a micro VM technology that totally replaces enterprise deployments on scale with Kubernetes, and it's going to be based on micro VMs. Watch, mark my words, this is coming.